Welcome everyone to the Velikovic Feshrift Symposium, our first such symposium in our history. Today we recognize the interest and passion of a person very important to all of us, who has served us so capably over the last 22 years, first as Executive Director of the American Association of Dental Schools, the double ADS, and now renamed, uh, the association renamed and now CEO and President of IDEA, the American Dental Education Association. Now, I know that many of you are sitting there and you're thinking this is usually the time in this annual s session when we typically have a plenary and specifically our political spotlight. But as you know, the theme of this annual session is collaboration. So it should come as no surprise to you that we could not find a politician, <laughs> let, let, al no, let alone two of them, in Washington or anywhere else in the country who could speak on the subject. We, we, did a, we did approach a few, but when they started to debate if the chairs on stage would be red or blue, or who would be seated on the left or the right side of the room, we de decided it was hopeless. I jest a little bit, but there is sadly some truth to this. So a number of us sit back in our magenta chairs at IDEA, you get it? Red and blue together make magenta. And we said, what better time to cel celebrate a person who embodies the concept of collaboration and who has made it a part of the fabric of this great association of ours? Who other than Dr. Richard Velikovic? What is a Feshrift? The word is of German origin and it translates as feast script or party writing. It's a celebra celebratory piece of writing or oration, as we will use in this symposium. It's a, it, it is a European academic tradition that honors a scholar, usually someone highly respected and, um, and of stature, like a retiring university president who has led with distinction for many years. Specifically, F. S. Schrift honors those things known to be important to that person, rather than the person directly and it is generally led by individuals who have been mentored by that person or who have worked closely with that person to move those particular interests or ideals forward. The theme of this symposium is virtue, and Dr. Leo Raus will be our host. He will explain that further ju in just a few minutes. Leo will be joined by four individuals who will speak about four areas of interest that have been cent central or core during Rick's remarkable tenure as our leader. For those introductions and to help shepherd us through this symposium, let me introduce Dr. Leo Rouse. 